This is Jufal Airfield. It is the gateway to Dolpo, one of the last districts in Nepal without a road link. These early morning flights are the only way in and the only way out. The airport was recently upgraded. Within two years, a road will connect Dolpo to the rest of Nepal. Dolpo has stunning scenery. There is Poksundo's waterfall and its deep blue lake. Its unique Bonpo culture predates Buddhism. With the road and airport, all this will soon be much more accessible to the rest of the world. The people along the trails and by the lake are preparing for the influx by building new lodges. But some trekking guides are worried. Dolpo is ready for tourists in flux, but it should be controlled. First of all, the people have to have better infrastructure for the different centers of tourists that can come up here. And most importantly, the locals have to be taught about how to keep their environment pristine and not let it be destroyed by all the rubbish that comes along with the influx of tourists. And it should be concentrated on quality rather than quantity. People here are also divided about the road. Some say it'll destroy tourism, while others hope it'll bring more trekkers and boost the economy. To prepare for the influx, the newly elected village council is widening the narrow and treacherous trail around Poksundo Lake. Yo, bato, ekdam pahila chahi, ekdam shano samasya cha. Yehi najiga imanji khoshi ko thiyo. Yaakta dheere choti khoshi ko cha. बाटो एकदम सानो भएर पर्यटकहरुलाई जान समस्या भएर हाम्रो वडाबाट विनियोजन भएको थोरै रकमबाट लगभग 12 लाखको लगानीमा यो बाटोको चौडाई अलि बढाउँदै छौ अर्को साल थप्दै थप्दै जाने छौ लोकल बिजनेसमेन आर बिल्डिंग न्यू होटल्स अलोंग द लेक टु अकोमोडेट नेपाली भिजिटर्स हु दे से स्पेंड मोर अन फूड एन्ड रेन्ट देन फरेन ट्रेकर्स फर डोल्पो as for many other parts of previously remote Nepal, the challenge will be to balance the local people's need for tourism income with the equally important goal of preserving the ecology and the culture of this fragile region.